within 20 it's minutes, you can see, you might see it. him involved into a deep yeah, yeah, I mean, you can see. It's a bizarre. Yeah, you can see where he's yeah, standing. Yeah. 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 Oh, it was our eyes. Oh, it's yeah. so, yeah. so yeah. deep. Yeah. That was odd. Oh, well, it was too dark in here anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're going to begin. It's 3.02. I call the meeting to order. Uh, we expect another member of the board to be here shortly, but I'm going to uh, begin with a statement, and then maybe we can take the roll after that, and he'll be here. In fact, there, there he is. The Board of Adjustment is a quasi-judicial board appointed by the mayor and city council. The board is made up part of city administration and is governed by both city and state codes and ordinances. The board is made up of five members. Currently, there are four members on the board due to an absence of Ms. Nancy Lee Zizi. God rest her soul. The chair cannot make a motion but has a vote. That is me. There must be three affirmative votes to pass. No motion made by the board will be the same as denial. Since we have four members present, then it would be a majority. So it would be three of the four needed to pass. In the event of a tie vote, that would also be the same as denial. So petitioners, if since we do not have a full board, they have the right to ask for their case to be tabled. If there's anyone that would like to have their case tabled, I don't know exactly of when another member would be appointed and even so there's no guarantee that all five of us would be present in the future but having said that would anyone like to have their case tabled there are none the board is empowered to vary the regulations of the zoning ordinance in harmony with its general purpose and intent where the board makes a finding of fact that there are practical difficulties or unnecessary hardships that may prevent carrying out the literal, literal provisions of the ordinance the board reviews conditional use requests and considers the following. Is the requested use consistent with the intent and purpose of the ordinance and with the comprehensive plan? Will the use have a substantial adverse effect upon adjacent property and the character of the neighborhood? And will the proposed use be compatible with the immediate neighborhood? The board also reviews variance requests. A variance request should only be granted if a petitioner establishes that an unnecessary hardship will result if zoning regulations are enforced. There are seven criteria for actions on a variance which were addressed in your application. A general rule of thumb is that the variance should prevent a hardship and not grant a special privilege not available to other landowners in similar situation. A necessary hardship means the land in question cannot yield a reasonable return if used only for the purpose allowed in that zone. The issue in question is due to unique circumstances and not to the central conditions of the neighborhood, the hardship must not be self-created and the use authorized by the variance will not alter the essential character of the locality. As a board of the city, all testimony is welcome. Decisions are based on facts and evidence allowed per city code. The chairperson, myself, will introduce your case and the city staff will provide details regarding the request. The petitioner will then be asked to come forward, present your case so testimony can be heard and recorded. Please come up to the podium here, state your name and address for the record. If the proceedings become lengthy, testimony may be limited by me to new facts or evidence not already presented. Objectors will then have an opportunity to address the board. Objectors shall also come to the podium here and state their name and address for the record and state the objections or concerns. I will then call for any board questions or discussion. Final summaries and additional comments may then take place. Based on a motion and a second, I will call for a vote.